It has officially been 10 years since the Red Wedding first aired. The episode was a masterpiece and helped explode Game of Thrones popularity. But how does the Red Wedding differ in the books? First off, Rob's wife, Talissa, was not in the books. In the books, Rob is married to Jane Westerling, who remains at Riverrun and is still alive. In the show, once Walter Frey's betrayal begins, Catelyn Stark grabs Walter's new wife. But in the books, she grabs Walter's developmentally impaired grandson, Aegon Frey, and offers to trade Aegon for Rob, a son for a son, but Walder cares not for the boy, leading to Catelyn executing Aegon. When Roose Bolton kills Rob Stark, he says Jaime Lannister sends his regards, instead of the Lannisters send their regards. And before the wedding began, Rob finalised his will in the books, and it is strongly implied that he legitimised Jon as a Stark, and named him as his heir, as he assumes Bran and Rickon are dead at this point.